Hello, for this episode, I invited a fashion designer uh, who's also a friend, of course, and he is part of the Galatea Duo, uh, who had a shop in Kamuning, and they also, he and his brother trained uh, beauty queens uh, that competed in national and international pageants. So please welcome Nikki Martinez. Thank you for saying yes to this interview. Uh-huh. Alam mo naman, yung mga... Ayun ako, you know, it's always, always my pleasure. Hmm. Alam mo naman, like, kung inuuna, yung mga talagang malapit sa akin, kasi hindi mahirap ka usap, di ba? I... <laughs> it's always my pleasure doing this for you. Thank you. Nikki, para lang sa benefit uh-huh. ng ating mga audience, syempre hindi naman kasi lahat nasa fashion, uh, pwedeng ano... Uh-huh. Um, tell, pakisabi sa amin yung brief background ni Nikki Martinez. Okay. Uh, uh, good day to everyone. My name is Nikki Martinez. I'm a graduate of uh, fine arts, majored in advertising at the University of Santo Tomas. Yes. Then after uh, college, I uh, worked for Mattel Philippines where I designed uh, Um, collector's items for Barbie dolls. For Barbie. Ay, naku, so, Nikki. yung mga Filipiniana nila. Sige nga, yes. Nikki. Mabuti yan na mention mo yung Mattel. Kasi uh, nakailang, yes. naka, nakadalawang virtual show ka sa akin na Barbie dolls. And that's the reason mm-hmm. kung bakit you had the fascination Oo. for to dress up Barbie. Oh, kasi nung start ng ano, designing career ko, siya ang first ano ko siya ang first model ko siya yung mm. ano uh, siguro when i worked for for barbie uh, siya yung talagang inexpect nag-experiment ako with design yan the, mm. the, ano uh, pero yung yung dinesign ko for them more on filipiniana kasi uh, yung the owner wants to you know create a special edition for a filipina barbie sila tita mirna 
Yes, a ritual Philippines. Yes, ritual. Yes, ritual. So nag, nagpupunta ka pala oh, niya sa ritual, oh, oh. Quezon Avenue. Nagpupunta yeah. ka noon. Yes, I go there, you know, to discuss yung mga, ano, yung mga projects, yung mga future projects. So naka ilang projects na ako for them. I, I did the Santa Cruz and Barbie, uh, Flores de Mayo Barbie, tapos yan, yung mga series ng Flora and Fauna, tapos yung mga uh, Island Philippines. Tapos I did also the ano the Centennial Barbie. Nikki, hindi ba mahirap gawin yung damit ng doll? Kasi maliliit eh, di ba? Ang uh, hirap po. Oo. Oh, oh. Luckily naman there yung may mga sewers, there's a factory for that during ano uh, during my stay there. So ano, I do the designs, tapos I pick the materials, tapos ay ito gamitin mong material, ito yung design niya. So sila na nag ano, nag-assemble ng ano, nung nung creation. Okay. Tas mm-hmm. Nikki, uh, part ka ng isang duo yes. who formed who formed the yeah. Galatea shop, no? Why did you decide Papa, but muna pag decision na na okay. partner yeah. sa kapatid mo who is also a fashion designers. Wala bang naging conflicts sa mga kliyente? Ah, okay. Nine, while I was still in Barbie, Kuya decided not to uh, leave na uh, dun sa shop where he worked for several years. Mm-hmm. So when he decided, tapos, oh, let's open up na, kasi syempre, support, we have supported parents naman na, sige, go na, you, you open na. na mm-hmm. ano. So talagang, it's a family thing. It's a family ano, decision then. So with regards to conflict, wala naman. Kasi ever since naman we're small, we were brought up na uh, to look after each other, to support each other. So, nung nagtayo naman kami ng shops, yung inaano pa rin namin na ay, supportahan. Okay. Tapos, Nikki, eventually, uh, mm-hmm. nag-discover na rin kayo ng mga beauty queens, no? Who competed here and abroad, no? And uh, you, okay. were both, uh-huh. su- you were both okay. successful yeah. in doing so, no? Ano yung part Mo mm-hmm. sa pag-form ng Galatea Queens? Uh, with that regards naman, usually, ang nag-start naman talaga niyan is si Kuya, si Kuya John T. Uh, yung, pero talagang yung love of pageantry, yung, kasi syempre, we started uh, loving watching Miss Universe or mm-hmm. Pilipinas, Mutya ng Pilipinas. Yes. Uh, eventually, syempre, luckily, we meet girls na nagmamodel or kaya may nagre-refer sa amin. So, eventually, um, we mentor them. Uh, we train them. Pero most of the time, talaga, si Kuya ang tumitingin. Oh, so, si usually, John ang D. job ko is yun, to, oversee, yeah, to oversee na if the girls are talagang prepared with regards to their clothing or kung kailangan rin nila mga polishing sa mga, uh, sa mga walking nila. Tapos, mm-hmm. luckily then, we met you also na ano na ano pag may mga shows ka uh, sinasama mo sila kasi talagang it's a good training ground din for the girls that we mm-hmm. mentor na na at least yung mga tinuturo namin sila they put into practice na niya. na yung mga tinuturo namin sa kanila tapos ni ki syempre dalawa kayong designers sa Galatea di ba mm-hmm. was there a yes. time was there yes. a moment uh-huh. na inisip mo na mag-shift na lang kaya ako sa ibang career para si Kuya na lang ang mag-designer sa amin. concentrate Oo. Sa isip Not ko ba yun? all. Kasi during that time, oo, during that time, malakas yung shop eh. Talagang uh, sunod-sunod yung mga uh, mga weddings, sunod-sunod mm-hmm. yung mga dibus. So talagang during that time, hindi mo may isip na to change career. As stressful as the the career is, mm-hmm. uh, we enjoy mm-hmm. doing it. Oo, oo, na na na, 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 kayong... na natutunan na. May sarili naman kayong kliyente eh, di ba? Kanya-kanya naman kayo. So wala talagang conflict, uh, ano? No conflict. Usually kasi pag may mga pumapasok ng shop, syempre since, since mas senior sa akin, mas nauna siya sa akin. Sa industry, usually may mga clients na talagang siya ang personal na hinahanap. So mm-hmm. minsan there are some clients that are open na 
ay, wala ba siya? Um, could you uh, design something for me? Uh, mm-hmm. That is okay. Pero minsan, may mga, may mga clients na, ay, wala siya, sige, I'll just come back. <laughs> that, that I respect also. Na, oh, na, ano, ah, kasi, kung, kung, kung gamay sila kay kuya, then I don't really mind. Sige, it's okay. Uh, is it okay for you to come back? Or let's reschedule na lang. Yun. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, usually, what the client wants talaga, yun yung talagang ano namin, uh, focus. Uh, tapos ano, Nikki, bukod sa kay John T, no, your brother, uh, sino pa ang tin- yes. uh, tinitingala mong designers in terms of uh, design mm-hmm. aesthetics and professionalism? Uh-huh. Siguro in the years of my career, siguro I was very lucky na nakakilala ko ng mga uh, designers along my career na, na talagang nagturo sa akin directly and indirectly. Kahit most of the time, natutunan ko what I've learned in the industry is mostly from my brother. Um, mm-hmm. Siguro, I can uh, attribute what I've learned also from uh, the late boy in Eustachio. Mm. Um, yes. yes. Um, he, he was a very good friend. Napupuntahan ko pa yung shop niya. So, nakikita ko how he works. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, siyempre si Boying love natin. Was, yeah, so... Sino pa? So, Meron tapos pa? I also admire uh, I also admire the works of Tito Francis Calakian. Mm-hmm. Kasi talaga, okay. I always admire his workmanship. Nakikita ko talagang from from ano uh, up close at saka at ano, distance. Nakita ko yung, yung clean Uh, yung linis ng gawa niya. Um, who else? Uh, Edgar San Diego. Yan, mm. the, the likes. The artist. Mm-hmm. No? Edgar San Diego. Ang tingin ko sa Edgar, hindi lang designer, he's an mm-hmm. artist. Di ba? Imagine, nagpipainting oh, pa. Oo, pero visually, he, even what he does in his creations, talagang, talagang, ano talaga, artworks. Oo, oh, correct. Mm-hmm. Anyway, nito, nito, mm-hmm. nitong pandemia, uh, Nikki, Ah, uh, syempre affected mm-hmm. tayo yung buong industriya, no lahat, designers, mm-hmm. live events Uh-oh. and everything, Uh-oh. no. Um, mm-hmm. w- anong mm-hmm. ginawa mo para maging viable ka pa rin bilang fashion designer? Did you accept works from clients? Uh, well, unfortunately with the two years na na of the pandemic, siguro the first months Uh, we decided to close nat muna kasi nga talagang it's really difficult to to handle the pandemic. Mm-hmm. So during that time, siguro uh, napag-usapan din namin ng kuya, we have to finish uh, yung mga projects na, na, na accept namin the previous years, the, the, the previous year uh, before the pandemic. Tatapusin lang muna namin. Then after that, uh, Uh, as much as possible to avoid muna kasi syempre uh, kasama namin sa bahay yung mother namin so mm-hmm. ayaw namin siya uh, maging uh, affected dun, dun sa ano namin ma-expose sa, sa, sa virus so as much oh, as possible diba? since nandito lang kami sa bahay we, we don't accept muna, uh, oh, muna. Um, clients so Kunyari, kung may mga tumatawag sa amin, we are lucky enough naman na may mga friends kami in the industry na na bukas pa. So we call them up na, is it okay na, for, na i-refer namin itong client namin because valued client namin ito. So mm-hmm. yung mga ni-refer naman namin kay Bigan, hindi, ano, alam naman namin na hindi kami mapapahiya because I know naman that they do good work also. Bagay. Eh, tulungan na lang. Di ba? Mm-hmm. Ganun na lang nangyari. Oo. Oh, oh. so, actually, sa ngayon talaga supportahan na lang na oh, oh, kung sino oh. man ang bukas ngayon. Uh, oh, supportahan oh. na lang natin dun sa mga businesses na bukas muna. At the, as meantime, long as, at the moment. As long as hindi rin kayo mapapahiya di ba? in terms of quality. Di ba? So, true. Oo. Oh, 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 oh. oh. <laughs> So, Nikki, uh, paano mo ginawang busy ang sarili mo nitong 
nitong despite what happened to the world ano mm-hmm. and uh, anong leksyon na natutunan mo from being locked down during the pandemic okay siguro during the first months uh, when we decided to close muna syempre we need to arrange uh, we need to transfer our stuff from one place to another kasi talagang ano eh, we need to uh, close physically the shop eh. mm-hmm. Tapos siguro um, uh, uh, two weeks after that, my mom was hospitalized. Dahil so surgery. So during that time, uh-huh. siguro our, no, um, um, she collapsed eh. So nung uh-huh. time na yun, talagang eh, in the, uh, uh, July, tapos medal pa nung nagsistart pa lang yung, yung kasagsaga nung lakas nung, mm-hmm. nung, nung pandemic eh. So, mm-hmm. talagang, luckily, I had kuya. To, so, kaya, kuya went with her to the hospital and stayed there for one week. So, Oy. during that time, yun, ang concentration namin, uh, during that time was to make, ano, to to make my mom healthier. Talagang yung focus namin during that time. So, hindi na namin muna inisip kung what, uh, what will happen to the shop. Though yung physically, close muna yung shop. Ang concentration namin during last year was ano was uh, our mom. Oh, si mami mo na ano? Siempre naman ano. And then Nikki, may may yes, na develop so, may, may na develop ka bang mm-hmm, skills na yung sinaran yung tapos, na yung. Mm-hmm. Sige, ngayon sinaran yung muna yung inyong shop. Meron ka bang ibang natutunan aside from the usual fashion design? Uh-huh. And bakit na isip mo ng itap yung ganong skill? Uh-oh. Uh okay. Uh in that uh, no, in that case, I have to thank you for that. Kasi nga um during siguro in the middle of uh, uh during the middle of uh May, siguro May, you you decided to to create a virtual uh, no, virtual uh fashion presentation. So during that time, syempre takot na takot pa ako lumabas na ano na 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 to deal with I uh syempre, I learned how to do photography mm. uh do videography and talagang learn it from my own na rin. so talagang sabi ko ah, sige since hindi ako makalabas I can't work with uh people in the industry siguro I can learn it uh, on my own I can learn it on my do photography and do d- the videography on my own. So, talagang ako na lang ang gumawa para at least may ma-present naman ako dun para sa show mo. O, oh, pa para ano, buhay tayong lahat, di ba? We're doing okay despite the pandemic, di ba? Oo. And, I'm, nag, kaya nga, ano, kaya nga I said yes, na-excite ako nung present mo sa akin yung ganong project. Eh. Ay, sige, ano, kasi, ano eh, talaga, ah, uh, You're, you just want to tell them that we're still here. Na nandito lang din kami. We're just waiting. Oh, oh. Hmm. So, ano, Nikki? Ngayong medyo umuokin na mga sitwasyon. Uh, pagdasal natin, di ba mm-hmm. karating dito yung Omicron variant? Uh, ano mm-hmm. ang plano mo? Ano ang plano mo sa susunod na limang taon uh-huh. as a fashion as a fashion designer? Mm-hmm. Mm, honestly, uh, it's too, ano, it's too, ano pa to tell. Pero just praying na sooner or later that God will lead me uh, to the right path, whether it's in fashion talaga or in other, ano, in other fields. So, pero I'm very open to that. Totoo, that's true. Anyway, Nikki. Mm-hmm. Uh, nagsimula kang bata, di ba? Mm-hmm. After graduation, nag-work ka na. Yes. And ngayon, na-reach mo na yung level na you're becoming mm-hmm. already one of the mm-hmm. formidables and senior in the fashion industry, no? Anong ma-advise mo sa mga gustong maging parte ng industriya uh-huh. as, as a designer? Anong pwede mo ma-impart na lesson or advice sa kanila? Mm-hmm. Um, sig- Good. Uh-oh. 
one siguro advice that I can give the younger ones who wants to start to become a designer, um, just be kind. Uh, mm. Kind lang. Kasi minsan, there are some designers na nakikilala mo, makasali lang sa isang fashion show or mabihisan lang itong artista na ito or isang influencer. Medyo tumataas na yung era mm. nila. So, usually, ano, when you're starting, ano, just be humble and just be kind to the people that you meet and the people that you work with. Don't, don't, I can say, uh, syempre, uh, learn to love your craft. Learn to, ano, to, to update. Learn to, ano, to, to be open to new ideas also. Kasi in my 21 years, syempre, talagang, uh, nandiyan yung updating, nandiyan yung experimenting. It's, mm. a, it's, it's a process of learning also. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So never stop, learning. never stop learning. Uh-huh. Remain grounded. Mm-hmm. No? Remain grounded. Oh, yes. Yeah. So, uh, uh-huh. huling, huling tanong, uh-huh. Nikki. Huling tanong. Kung, kung darating yung panahon na kailangan mo ng tigilan ng pagiging designer uh-huh. and um, ano yung gusto uh-huh. mong iwanan na legasiya? as Nikki Martinez. Mm. Siguro ano, I like to be remembered as a kind designer who does timeless work. Kunyari, I would like to see like uh, 10 years from now or uh, 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 Several years from now, I can see somebody who's wearing what I designed. Na mm. ano, na, ay, nasusuot pa rin hanggang ngayon. Oo. That ba? I want to be remembered. Oh, pero may nakikita, talagang, may nakikita ka na ba na ginawa mo 10 years ago? So, so, actually, uh, honestly speaking, may mga clients ako na nagpo-post sila online or uh, uh, sa social media na, ay, ginawa ko pa to years ago. Ha? Uh, at least nasusuot pa nila. Oo, oh, happy ako. At least until now, I can still wear it. And they still appreciate the the uh, the workmanship they did. So no, talagang oh. doon dun medyo high for a, designers, uh, to, for a designer to hear that na even years after na ginawa mo pa sa kanila yun, nasusuot pa rin nila. Oh, ganoon naman dapat, 'di ba? 'Yun ang marka na isang designer, 'di ba? Yung yung kahit na 10 years, 15 years na isusuot pa rin yung damit, 'di ba? Oh, oh. Oh, 'yun. 'Yun, 'yun pwede kong pwede. Gusto kong iiwan sa industry na talagang ay uh, gawa pa sa akin ito ni Nikki na even five, uh, five, five years after. So talagang wala, 'yun lang talagang legacy mo pwede kong iwanan sa fashion industry. Ah, pero sa ngayon, laban pa rin tayo. Ha? Laban lang muna tayo ng laban. Yes. Oo. Oh, ay nako. I appreciate, uh, appreciate the things that you do, Kata. Kasi talagang, uh, ano eh, talagang you, you're uplifting the industry pa rin kahit pa paano. Mm-mm. Laban lang. Nako, Nikki. Anyway, thank mm-hmm. you for this yes. interview. Uh-oh. Thank you for saying yes. And uh, I hope that our viewers learned a lot from Nikki Martinez. He is another designer in the industry sa dami-dami. I mean, mer- metong, meron siyang sariling marka. I know one, pag alam kong, ah, pag nakita ko na damit ni Nikki Martinez, alam kong Nikki Martinez yun. So, I hope that uh, you, you appreciate uh, my interview with uh, Nikki. So, Nikki, thank you. Ha? Hi, my pleasure. Thank you also, Kata. And hopefully, and I'm praying also that uh, the industry will, uh, will come alive again in the coming future. Okay. But thank you. Thank you also. Okay. Thanks, mm-hmm. Nikki. Thank you.